Philadelphia Flyers back at home tonight. First of two consecutive home games and three of their next four are going to be played at the Wells Fargo Center. Tonight, it's Hockey Fights Cancer Night as they welcome in the Carolina Hurricanes. Hello, everyone. I'm Brian Smith. Welcome into this Flyers game day preview. Flyers spent the morning here at Flyers Training Center in New Jersey getting ready for the contest tonight against the Hurricanes. Third time they've played them so far this season. They've split the first two games so far, and the Flyers looking for more of what they had the last time these two teams played when the Flyers came away with the victory. They're coming off the win on Long Island on Saturday against the Islanders, which was a bounce back from the loss to the Rangers on Black Friday. A couple of pretty different games from the perspective of head coach John Tortorella in terms of how the Flyers played away from the puck said that uh, every now and then you're going to need to reset in that regard and that's what Saturday was so they're looking to continue that again tonight against the Hurricanes. We caught up with John Tortorella and some of the players before the game to get their thoughts on the matchup. Yeah I thought uh, we were definitely hungry on pucks uh, down low uh, keeping holding on to them and, and uh, creating our own offense and then uh, the way we tracked and uh, block shots and, and uh, kind of sacrificed uh, was a big difference. New the Rangers are a good rush team and, and uh, we didn't do a good job of handling it but uh, had a good bounce back game and, and guys battled hard and, and uh, created a lot so uh, we got to build off it. We got a, uh, another four big games here, uh, divisional games and, and uh, it's big for us. Yeah, the, the Carolina is probably uh, probably one of the highest pressure teams. Uh, uh, they're they're man on man all over the place. They can skate. They're a good team, a really good team. And uh, we we've got to be aware of their quickness. It's a quicker team, a little bit different team than the Islanders. Um, but when you play Carolina, you end up on the boards. You end up grinding it out with them. Uh, uh, so our our readiness is very important in how quick we play, uh, and and not not be on. We need to be on it. We need to pressure too, and uh, not let them dictate the pace of the game. So it's the second and final visit of the season for the Hurricanes here tonight. After this game, these two clubs will not meet until March. But the uh, Flyers and Hurricanes right next to each other in the standings right now. Flyers one point back of Carolina, who is second in the Metro. Flyers are third points-wise. In fact, if the playoffs started today, the two teams would meet in the first round. So that's how close things are right now between these two clubs. Flyers continuing this run of consecutive games against divisional opponents. After the Devils game on Thursday, it will continue with a home and home against the Pittsburgh Penguins on Saturday and Monday. So it's the Flyers and the Carolina Hurricanes tonight at Wells Fargo Center. Again, it is a 7.30 puck drop tonight, and it is an ESPN Plus and Hulu broadcast for you this evening in terms of where you can see the game. You can hear the radio broadcast tonight with Tim Saunders and Todd Fedorik on 97.5 The Fanatics. So we hope to have you along with us as the Flyers take on the Carolina Hurricanes.